Good morning guys from Kaosan. After having a great night and recharge my energy, it's time to go to the Grand Palace. But before that, just in front of the Kaosan police station, don't miss this delicious street food. I'm very thankful to this man for serving me delicious pad thai and pork basil. Pad thai is Thai noodle with some vegetables, and it will not be complete without pork rice. Walking to Grand Palace in the morning, I pass some artistic monument and meet some people praying on a shrine. Bangkok sunlight can be very scorching, so don't forget to apply some sunscreen before you go for a walk. I'm heading to the Grand Palace, so let's check the palace. Grand Palace is one of the most visited attractions in Bangkok, so I prefer to come early in the morning before the gate opens. But look what happened! Visitors have waited outside even before the gate opened. Grand Palace has a strict dress rule, so make sure you dress appropriately, not to wear sleeveless shirt. Welcome to the Grand Palace. A hermit statue, a patron of Thai medicine, will greet you. Six pairs of demon guardians standing at the gate of the gallery facing to the chapel of the Emerald Buddha are so fantastic. Mural paintings which depict the story of Ramakien the Thai version of the Indian Ramayana epic surrounds the temples and the buildings. These grand buildings and pavilions were built during the reign of King Rama I in 1789 this amazing golden stupa saved the lord buddha relics
everything that I see in the Grand Palace is fine art with great details. A miniature of Angkor Wat in Cambodia can also be found here. Behind this wall is the Emerald Buddha, a Buddha image which was carved from a block of jasper. It is the most important Buddha image in Thailand, and the king is the only one who can touch the image. The Grand Palace Complex consists of not only the royal residence and throne halls, but also a number of government offices, as well as the renowned Temple of the Emerald Buddha. It covers an area of 218,000 square meters. Grand Palace is always crowded. It is almost impossible not to be photobomb, but it is worth for a visit. So don't ever miss this place when you visit Thailand.